What's up, guys? Macron's here. Got here. Battle versus Ufus or Rafa, I guess. Um, from a Smoking Wi Fi Battle Finder thingy, Majigger. And uh, yeah, it's a random battle. And I thought I might as well post it because, yeah, why not? So, anyways, this is OU. Uh, this guy's running a Sun Team. And I noticed, um, well, for one thing, I wouldn't. If I was running a Sun Team and I saw a T-Tar, I would not lead with, you know, Ninetales. So I was thinking he might lead with something weird. So I lead off with my Terrakion. And uh, I just go for a Stone Edge on the Venusaur as he switches to a Victini. Now, I don't know what kind of mindset or knowledge or thinking process you would have to go into Victini on a Terrakion. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. Anyways, so I go for the Stone Edge, kill him, and he goes into Scizor. Now, other than this Scizor, um, pretty much Terrakion demolishes his entire team. Unless he has the sun up. Um, so I'm pretty sure he won't risk going for uh, Super Power or U Turn. And uh, I know Magnezone's not going to be very useful um, other than trying to kill the Scizor. So I thought, I'll go into it. And if he doesn't Bullet Punch, whatever. If he does, well, Dead Scizor is dead. And, you know, I smack him in the face with the Choice Specs Thunder. So yeah, I go for that. And um, Scizor's dead now. So that's all good. He goes into Hydreigon, um, yeah, um, and I switch, I go into Rotom, knowing that he would go for Fire Blast, and, uh, you know, it is a Sun Team, I was thinking, is he gonna go Focus Blast or Fire Blast, but since he was in a Sun Team, I was thinking he might Fire Blast, or I might have both, you never really know, because he's not gonna run Surf, so, yeah, but whatever, I see that he's Life Orb, and I was thinking, alright, so he's not Choice Scarfed. So, I know Rotom's not going to be very useful, knowing that he has two grass types and a Ninetales. So, I'm going to decide to death fodder it, or just stay in. If he doesn't kill me, he doesn't kill me, you know, that's good. But, uh, if he goes for Draco, he kills me, as in Terrakion, and starts smacking his face with close combats. And, you know, the story's good. So, that's, a, that's what I intend to do. And I uh, go in a nice rack, and go for that big close combat from a choice-baited Terrakion. And Hydreigon dies. So, that's how that works. Yes. So, at this point, I think it's already, what, 5 to 3? So, yeah. That's uh, looking very good. And um, all he has left is Ninetales, Venusaur, and a Leafeon. I know, Leafeon? That doesn't really make sense. But whatever. Anyway, so I know that if he wants to do anything, he has to send in Ninetales and then switch out. Except he doesn't switch out. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, I was thinking he might go into Venusaur. I mean, I'm obviously choice spin a Terrakion. I mean, I don't know. I don't know about you. I guess he wouldn't really know if I'm choice man or not because I did go for Stone Edge in the close combat. But, yeah. I don't know. Yeah. So, Ninetales dies. All he has left is Venusaur and Leafeon. Um, again, no real use for Magnezone. So, I decided to just go into it to death fodder it because it's not going to be very useful versus two grass types. So, yeah. Especially two grass types that, in theory, could beat Magnezone easily with either Earthquake, HP Fire, or what have you. So, he goes for Solar Beam. Does, doesn't really do anything, but he does go for the HP Fire and take out Magnezone. So, yeah, there's that. So, I'm going to go and do Tyranitar um, and go and demolish this thing with a couple fire blasts. I know that he does have HP fire and solar beam. I'm hoping he doesn't have I'm hoping the set he's running is the is basically the demolish everything but Garchamp set which was a uh, sludge bomb, solar beam and HP fire with growth, which not going to lie, if you actually look at the threats in OU, it pretty much demolishes everything that isn't Garchomp. I mean, I think maybe now since it's a different meta game there might be more walls and stuff, but, uh, no, pretty much it, it demolishes that, so, um, yeah, whatever. Um, I guess he has that, doesn't have Sleep Powder, doesn't have Earthquake, so, yeah, I guess he, he loses. So, um, yeah, or maybe the Demolish Gar, everything but Garchomp set was with Earthquake and not Solar Beam. I don't remember. No, that wouldn't make sense, because there's Glyscore. Yeah. So, I don't know. Anyways, but, um, I go for two Fire Blasts. He ends up poisoning me with Sludge Bomb, which I find is hilarious. But whatever. Um, Fire Blast takes out the Venusaur, and it dies. So, yeah. And all he has left is a, is a Leafeon. 
it's pretty much a good game from here. And, um, yeah, that's pretty much that. Um, yeah. So, I don't know what really else to say. He goes for the Leaf Blade, which I found this kind of interesting. That uh, he went for Leaf Blade, um, which is a Life Orb Leaf Blade, and I live. And I'm like, okay, I'll live your Leaf Blades, um, and kill you with Fire Blast. Actually, the Fire Blast doesn't even kill the Leafeon, so I don't even know, like, maybe this was some kind of bulky or... No, maybe maybe it's just both Titar's weak and Leafeon's really weak. So, yeah, I don't know. But, either way, um, Tyrant's Heart dies to poison. I send in my Landorus. Landorus goes for the Hidden Power Ice. And, um, I... I beat Leafeon. So, yeah, that's a good game. Uh, good game Rafa, or Euphis, or whatever, whatever you pronounce your name, or whatever. Um... Yeah, so I'm kind of wanting more battles, more standard battles, because this wasn't very good. So, <laughs> um, I am taking full-on requests on Skype again, and uh, so just contact me on Skype, and I'll hook up a battle with you. So, yeah, that's pretty much that. Comment, rate, subscribe, guys, and I'll see you.